Hey guys, let's see how to log into an Xfinity router. So I have it here and here I have a computer and also a cell phone that I can check the IP address of the router, okay? So the first thing here is find the IP address. I'm using a Mac. You can also use Windows to find the IP address. It's a little bit different, but the first thing that I have to do is to find the IP address. I'm gonna show you how to work with the cell phone as well. So just wait for it. So here with the Mac, you just come here to your Wi-Fi settings. There we go. I see here that I'm connecting to the router, right? And I come to the Wi-Fi settings. In here, I find my router signal that I'm connected to. And I click the three dots. And here, network settings. The way I can find the IP of the router, okay? Here's the IP of the computer and here's the IP of the router. It may be different for you, of course. So mine here is 10.0.0.1. So I just close here and I come and I type it here, okay? So 10.0.0.1, there we go. And the router is going to ask for the username and password. At first is admin and the password is password, all lowercase, okay? I already changed mine, so I'm gonna type here a different one and just hit login. So it takes a while to log in. You see here that's working because this thing is working and there we go. Now I have access to my Xfinity router, okay? So I have all the settings here and I'm good to go. And when I finish, I just click here to log out again. And there we go, right? With the cell phone, to find the IP address is simple as well. So basically you come here to the Wi-Fi settings. Let me just bring here in here in the settings, go to Wi-Fi settings, just like you do in the computer. And here you see that I'm connecting to my repeater. That's just right here. So it's, it's a different device. I don't want to connect to the repeater because I'm gonna get a different IP address. I need to connect my cell phone directly to my router, which is different, right? Let me just show you here that I have an IP address for the connection with the repeater here. So when I come here, you see that I go down and here's the IP address of the router, right? Which means is the IP address of the repeater. So I'm not going to connect to this one. This one is connecting to the router via cable. That's why I can have access to, to the internet using my cell phone, right? So what I have to do now is just connect directly to the router. So basically here on my cell phone, I come back here to the Wi-Fi and I connect here to the signal that represents my router, right? So just connect here, click here. And now I can just check the IP, which we, we already know from the computer there, but that's the way you can check, right? Okay, 10.0.0.1, because now it's connecting to the router and it's getting the IP address from this router. This is the IP address of the phone and this is the router's one. Now. You just do the same, just go to your computer and connect from there to logging to the Xfinity router, okay? So I hope this helps. Please leave your comments here. Did it work for you or didn't? And also subscribe to this channel, leave your thumbs up in your comments and I see you in the next one.